Only I may touch his clothes. Yes, God. <laughs> Watch her expectation now. She can't get to him because there's a crowd. Yeah, all right. All right. <laughs> But her expectation causes her to make a prophetic declaration. Okay, let me help somebody. Because you got to learn how to make a prophetic declaration despite what's going on around you. You cannot allow situations and circumstances to dictate to the prophetic word that's in your mouth. The Bible says, and you shall decree a thing, and it shall be what? Oh, I ain't got no Bible readers in here tonight. I'm going to say that if, if you sound, she decreed what she wanted. Yes. My God. People of God, Jesus. you got to learn how to open up your mouth. You got to learn how not to wait on a prophetic conference to come to the city. But sometimes you got to have your own prophetic conference and get in that mirror and prophesy to yourself. All right, let me help you. Let me help you. Cause everybody that say the Lord said, the Lord ain't saying nothing. Y'all done got quiet on me. She said, if. Only. Oh. Somebody say only. Oh. <laughs> I can touch him. Mm. Watch this. She said, I shall. Oh Somebody say shall. Shall. What you got to understand about the word shall, it simply means it has to happen. All right now. Mm. Lord, Lord, Lord. I promise I'm going to get out your way. Okay. See? See, see, let me help you. Maybe the reason why some things have not happened for you yet oh is because you ain't using the right language. See, you know, uh, what the devil does is he tries to give us, Dr. Walker, he tries to give us paralysis. All right, come on. <laughs> or he tries to paralyze us when it comes to fear. And so what happens is a lot of times we don't say the right stuff. Okay. And instead of speaking what we know God said to us, we start speaking what we feel. All right, now. Oh, come on. Oh, because one thing I have discovered out of 19 years of preaching this gospel, it is not about how you feel. Because right, sometimes you just not going to feel like it. All right. Come on. <laughs> Maybe she did. But she said, I shall. Yes. I shall. Let me help you. I don't know what your issue is tonight. My God. But here's your word. Mm -hmm. Go speak to that issue. All right. And say it shall. All right. Now. Oh, I ain't got no faith walkers in here. Let me help you understand something. You got to serve the devil a notice after tonight and say, devil, it shall. Okay, watch this. You got to say, I shall be healed. I shall be delivered. I shall be rich and not broke. I shall get my breakthrough. I shall get my increase. you've been believing from the enemy. You know why so many people are oppressed, frustrated, and all this stuff, suicidal, and all this stuff, is because they have not learned how to say the right stuff. After tonight, prophetically, I'm declaring that your language will change. Okay, people don't know what y'all want to prepare the word. That's your prophetic word. After
tonight I'm declaring and decreeing over everybody that's in this house that your language shall be I shall. Okay, it's 9.15. We finna go. Thank you, Jesus. Don't get mad with me if I don't call nobody out by their name and that because this is a prophetic word right here. So you better catch this thing. We finna get out of here. Hallelujah to God. 29 says, watch this. After her language changed. Watch this, Nikki. The text says, suddenly. <laughs> or instantly or immediately. Watch this. The fountain of blood was what? Come on, we gotta say this again. Was what? Dried up. Was what? Dried up. Now, when did it happen? Immediately. 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 It happened right away. Yes. God. Here's your word for tonight. That when you choose to operate in expectation, the stuff that you've been believing God for is going to happen right away. So tell your neighbor. We're going to go home now. Say neighbor. Say God is getting ready to do a suddenly in my life. I waited long enough. I cried long enough. I suffered long enough. But it's my time to get what God told me I can have. Good night, y'all. I got to go home. Cause I gotta get up early in the morning But I dare five people To stand up on your feet And say my God Is gonna turn this thing Around I came to encourage you tonight If the show witness conference That many of the afflictions Of the righteous But God Holy Ghost say, he said, tell them. 